It's Howard Samura from the province and theprovince.com. Today, looking at the five greatest athletic moments in the 50-year history of Simon Fraser University Athletics. In 1976, a kid from Port Coquitlam High School made his presence felt on the Burnaby Mountain campus. His name, none other than Terry Fox. In that year, Terry Fox was a member of the school's junior varsity basketball team. And stories of Terry are all about the incredible courage and determination he showed while playing on that basketball team. Of course, a diagnosis of cancer would come soon after, and Terry Fox would embark on the Marathon of Hope, eventually becoming an icon in Canadian history. Daniel Agali defected from the Nigerian wrestling team during the 1994 Commonwealth Games, and very soon after became a stalwart for the Simon Fraser University wrestling team. The career of Agali included a 116-0 perfect record, while with the clan and, of course, winning gold at the 2000 Olympic Games in Sydney, Danny Lagali kneeling to the ground and kissing the Canadian flag in an iconic moment in Canadian sports history. What are the chances that two of the greatest kickers in the history of professional football would both come from the same football program? Indeed, that is the case at Simon Fraser University with Dave Cutler and Louis Pisaglia. Cutler, of course, going on to play for the Edmonton Eskimos, one of the greatest kickers in CFL history, and he was followed by Louis Pisaglia, of course, with the BC Lions, who would become the leading scorer all time in the history of professional football. Jay Triano was a recruit out of Niagara Falls, Ontario, and he came to the Simon Fraser University campus in the fall of 1977, and over the course of his four-year career would leave by setting 11 school records. Of course, Jay Triano these days an assistant coach with the Portland Trailblazers, the head coach of the Canadian men's national team, but always a unique part of the basketball history at Simon Fraser University. Lauren Davies was the first athletic director in the history of Simon Fraser University and the reason Lauren merits mention as one of the greatest athletic moments in Simon Fraser history was his decision for the school to compete not against Canadian competition but from the start to test their skills against U.S. schools. It was a groundbreaking move and has led to Simon Fraser eventually becoming the only non-U.S. school competing in the NCAA.